Hi, this is Mike Garner from uh, Mind Focus Groups and MrMikeGarner.com and I am making this short presentation on YouTube and on my website um, from a hotel room in Liverpool and the reason that I'm in a hotel making this uh, short presentation is because I'm down with my daughter who's having major surgery on her elbow today and over the last few weeks also we've had some family challenges and anybody who knows me through my website and from coming to my workshops and seminars knows that I teach mental and emotional programming. I'm into energy, consciousness and reality and I just felt it was important to express my desire to be real and my intention for you to be real. A lot of people see my posts on Facebook and my tweets and it's all positive stuff and I'm a very positive, motivated, driven guy and I brought my family up in that way as well. But the fact of the matter is, is that at any time in my therapies, in my workshops, I could change places with you because I am just like you. There's nothing special about me. I live in the same world that you live in. Um, people say, how do you stay so positive? And I work on that. It's something that I practice daily. And I'm very keen on keeping it real, keeping and being grounded. If you're not grounded and you've got your head in the clouds and you live in a dream world, trying to be positive when things aren't that positive around you, I don't think that's very authentic. And I'm very much into being authentic. Lots of people posting things on Facebook and saying things, being gurus. And sometimes I think... They're not only kidding themselves, but they're actually kidding and giving a false uh, impression about themselves and about the way things are in the world. The world is a huge classroom. Whatever happens to you is there for you to learn from. And you'll always have what we call good and bad things. Now, there's no such thing as good and bad things. There's just things. These things happen. There's no such thing as a good or bad day. There's just a day in the same way that there's no such thing as good or bad weather, there's just weather, and it's how we perceive it. Now, I don't want to have my spine injury. It doesn't help me help you, but it is what it is, and I've learnt a lot from my injury in learning to cope with it, deal with it, and get on with it. It's been challenging because my background is martial arts, and as a fourth down mixed martial arts instructor, it's not convenient that now, some days, I can't fasten my shoelaces. But... It's taught me a lot about myself and the vulnerability of being mortal and it's helped me learn to cope with pain and to cope with myself and get over myself to get on with my life. And that's what my daughter's going through at the moment. And my wife is going through this at the moment as well, if you know my family story. I'm not here to talk about me and my family, but I am here to tell you that you've got to be real and these are real things that are going on. But it's not going to spoil my day. It's not going to spoil our life. We're going to get on with it. And that's what you've got to do. You've got to get on with it. You've got to step up and take these things as challenges and overcome the challenges. And there's a process to doing that. There's a process within your mind, consciousness, and the way that you think and process these situations and challenges. And there's something that you can do with your energy system, your spirit, your inner spirit, your inner power, so that these things don't leave you powerless and hopeless. You've always got power and you've always got hope and you can make a decision to use these challenges that the world and life throws at you to rise above them and to become what I call an eagle. I'm not going to put my head down and scratch round and moan and complain. I could, but you won't catch me doing that. It's people a lot worse off than me, a lot worse off than my daughter or Chaya, my wife or my son or any member of my family or friends that are challenged. Anybody in the world that's challenged, there's always somebody worse off than you. Sometimes at the time you don't perceive it or you don't see it in that way, but look round and we are in the UK and in Europe extremely lucky. Now that's a political and a social uh, economic situation which I'm not going to go into on this presentation. But what you've got to do is you don't be a chicken and look down, be an eagle, rise and soar above these issues, these situations, these challenges so that you can actually get some energy from them, learn something from them, develop and grow beyond them. 
I have processes to do this. And even though I've got these things going on in my life at the moment, I'm still available to help you because it's what I do. And I find that when you help other people, it lifts yourself. There's nothing that you can do better than help somebody else, raise the self-esteem of somebody else, and it raises your self-esteem. When you empower somebody else, it empowers you. If I'm giving you Reiki, if I'm doing transactional analysis, non-hypnotic counselling or a hypnotic process, it makes me feel good. Helping you feel good and overcome the problems that stand in the way of your health and happiness. And that's how I get my health and energy and happiness. So, you'll see me posting things on Facebook, but I'm still available to help you. Even while things like this are going on in my life, because things are always going to go on in my life, good and bad things. But they're not good and bad, they're just learnings and it's just the way I perceive them. So I hope that you learn to perceive your situations and challenges as challenges and I can help you with that process by working with your energy and consciousness so that you can have a positive outcome, whatever happens. So I'm looking forward to hearing from you. I'm available to you. I'm in a hotel at the moment talking to you on YouTube or on my website or wherever you're viewing this video. But when you want me, I'm available on my mobile 07860138265 or on my home number 01492512232 and my answer machine will take it and I'll receive the calls or you can contact me through any of my websites and you'll get all those details on the page where you're viewing this presentation. So take care, I'm taking care, and I'll take care of you if you call me. So I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Bye for now.